Before we jump in, I do earn a referral fee when you use the services and companies I demonstrate in the video, but there is no additional cost to you. I chose them because they're the best in the industry and you're safe with them. Are you and your spouse thinking about starting a business together? Well, you're in the right place if you've been considering how best to structure your joint venture. Today we're diving into a popular choice for many couples, forming an LLC or a limited liability company. An LLC is a unique business structure, blending elements of partnerships and corporations, offering a flexible management structure and legal protections. It's a way to ensure your personal assets are safe from business liabilities. For married couples going into business together, an LLC can be particularly appealing. It allows you to combine your entrepreneurial dreams with the legal and financial protections an LLC provides. Whether you're planning to open a cozy coffee shop or a disruptive tech startup, Understanding how to form an LLC can be a crucial step on your entrepreneurial journey. So stick around, because in this video, you'll learn the step-by-step -step process of forming an LLC as a married couple. Why might you and your spouse want to form an LLC for your business? This is a question that many entrepreneurial couples might ponder. The answer lies in the multitude of benefits that a limited liability company, or LLC, can offer. First and foremost, forming an LLC provides liability protection. This is a crucial advantage as it separates your personal assets from those of your business. In the unfortunate event that your business faces a lawsuit or incurs debts, your personal assets, such as your home or personal savings, remain untouched. This layer of protection can provide a great deal of peace of mind. Another significant benefit of forming an LLC is the tax advantages it brings. With an LLC, you can choose how you want your business to be taxed. You may opt for a pass-through taxation, where the business income, losses, deductions, and credits pass through to the owners, who then report these on their personal tax returns. This avoids the double taxation often experienced by corporations. Moreover, being a married couple, you can file jointly, further simplifying your tax situation. In addition, running an LLC is relatively straightforward in terms of operation and management, Unlike corporations, LLCs are not required to have a board of directors or hold annual meetings. This reduces administrative tasks and allows you and your spouse to focus more on growing your business. Furthermore, forming an LLC as a married couple can also enhance your business's credibility. Having the LLC designation in your business name can make your business appear more professional and trustworthy to potential clients, customers, or investors. Finally, an LLC also offers flexibility in profit distribution. As owners, you and your spouse can decide how to divide the profits, regardless of the ownership percentage. This can be particularly beneficial if one spouse contributes more time or resources to the business. As you can see, there are several advantages to forming an LLC as a married couple. From liability protection and tax benefits, to operational simplicity and credibility enhancement, an LLC can be a smart choice for entrepreneurial couples. So, how do you and your spouse go about forming an LLC? That's the question we're going to answer in this part of the video, providing you with a detailed step-by-step -step guide to setting up your very own limited liability company. Let's dive right in. Step 1. Choosing a business name. This is more than just a creative exercise. Your business name is your brand, the first thing potential customers will see or hear about your company. It needs to be unique, not just within your state, but ideally across the country. That's because you want to avoid any legal issues down the line related to trademark infringements. You'll also need to include LLC or Limited Liability Company in the name. Step 2. Filing the Articles of Organization. This is the official document that brings your LLC into existence. It's a relatively simple document that outlines the basics of your business, such as its name, purpose, and the names of the members. In this case, you and your spouse. Each state has its own form and fees for the Articles of Organization, so you'll need to check with your state's Secretary of State office or equivalent. Step 3. Creating an Operating Agreement Now, this is a crucial step that some couples overlook. An operating agreement is a legal document that outlines the ownership and operational procedures of your LLC. It helps to prevent misunderstandings by setting clear expectations about partners' roles, responsibilities, and what happens if one partner wants to leave the business. Even though you're married, it's still essential to have this document to keep your business running smoothly. Step 4. Obtaining an Employer Identification Number or EIN. This is essentially a social security number for your business. It's used by the IRS for tax purposes. You can apply for an EIN for free through the IRS website and you should do this as soon as possible after your LLC is formed. Step 5. 
registering for state taxes. Depending on your state and the nature of your business, you may need to register for one or more state-specific tax identification numbers. Again, your state's Secretary of State office or equivalent should have the information you need. Step 6. Getting business licenses and permits. Depending on what your business does, you may need certain licenses or permits to operate legally. These can range from general business licenses to specific permits related to your industry or type of business. Always check with your city, county, and state to see what licenses or permits you need. Step 7. Setting up a business bank account. This is crucial for keeping your personal and business finances separate, which is a key aspect of maintaining your LLC's liability protection. It's also a good idea to get a business credit card to help separate personal and business expenses. And there you have it, the process of forming an LLC as a married couple. Remember, forming an LLC is a big step that can provide significant benefits for you and your spouse, but it's important to do it correctly to ensure those benefits are realized. Good luck on your business journey. We, what should you and your spouse keep in mind when forming an LLC? And there are resources available to guide you through the process. If you are confused or consider these steps to be difficult, you can employ a professional formation service to file your LLC. The Z is an amazing company that will guide you through creating your LLC. They even have a service where they will file your LLC for you without you going through any hassle. Watch the rest of the video where I will show you how to form an LLC in under 5 minutes through Bazi. They are one of the best entity formation platforms in the market that charges $0 for their service. Now, let me just show you what types of services Bazi provides to business owners. After arriving on their website here you will see the list of all the services they provide. Under the Start Your Business section, you will see four of their key services, which are form an LLC, C Corporation, S Corporation, and Nonprofit. As you can see, there are three different packages silver, gold, and platinum. And the first thing that's worth mentioning is that the state fee does not change. You can see it's $236 in all the packages. Some of the extra services that are included in this package are preparing and filing the articles of organization, unlimited name searches, free registered agent for one year, and unlimited phone and email support. Next, the gold package which costs $249 and this is the package I highly recommend which filing EIN which is a business tax number, form 2553, operating agreement, business bank account, lifetime company alerts, tax consultation, etc. In the next section, Bazi is asking you to provide your LLC name and its designation. After that, ask you whether you want to get a registered agent through them or not. Getting a registered agent is a legal requirement in order to file an LLC in any state. Bazi is providing registered agent service free for one year and after that, it's $119 per year. Bazi is asking you whether you want to get an EIN or not. In the next section, Bazi will ask you whether you will set up a small U.S. business bank with Bank of America. Then if you want to get a free tax strategy or consultation call with them. In the Bazi dashboard, if you go to legal and then licenses and permits, they can do this research for you and make sure that you have all the proper licenses and permits. After providing all the information, Bazi will be the one handling all the documents and registering your LLC on your behalf so you won't need to go through any of these hassles.